Well, first off, I kind of, well, the video's not about this, but I wanted to show you, it's starting to look good. Yeah, I'm just getting the StreamYard thing, a majig set up, and, um, yeah, that, uh, the camera, the webcam hanging from the overhead, um, or from the, uh, the hanging plant seems to be doing good, and then I'm going to use that second camera there so I can chit-chat with people. I think that'll be good. And also, because Leo is sleeping there, you can see the bump there, that's Leo. Uh, hey puss, hey puss, oh, you puss, but anyways, I'm not, uh, um, well, I'll talk about how I'm going to play this game uh, later on when, when I start the live stream, but uh, I'm going to be, sorry about the uh, seasickness, sorry, um, so I'll be using that for, uh, yeah, it's a bucket of dice game, not because that was the original uh, way I did things, uh, but I started morphing um, this miniatures game to be played uh, at conventions and I realized that lots of people like to um, throw lots of dice around but uh, to throw lots of dice around with Leo sleeping and uh, you don't know well if you know about anything about Leo he's extremely skitterish uh, so the normal bowl I would use would make a lot of noise and I was thinking also you guys probably don't want to hear a big crash of dice so I was like well I'll just uh, put a piece of felt in um, a baking pan and that should uh, do the trick. Anyways, the, the main thing uh, why I'm doing this video is because I want to be honest with you people. If I'm not honest with you, then what? Uh, I might as well just delete this flipping channel and the whole nine yards. Oh, oh, there goes the furnace. And it's about this game and about the fact that I made a mistake here, got confused at first, went to my Germany book, still couldn't find the mistake. And instead of admitting to you guys, you know what, I'm going to have to, because it's about me now, not about the game. Um, I don't know where to put you. But, uh, I'll put you here, kind of thing. But uh, yeah, it's about me, man. Uh, the fact that I'm, I remember I mentioned I've had a previous, I uh, made a previous video of uh, the fact, sorry, <laughs> that uh, I'm immature. And it's not just about, a, like I said, about immature, about, oh, you know, I, I like playing and so on and so forth. It's also about being um, not grown up and admitting my mistakes or trying to cover them or lie and obviously that's what I would have ended up doing that's why you can see at the very end of the video I start becoming a bit abrupt or whatever because it's I don't want to admit oh by the way Chris um, you didn't do proper record keeping and uh, you can't figure out if there was an actual now you have to go and do a lot of backtracking with your record book keeping why didn't you just admit that to your whatever's why did you have to be some uh, um, uh, you know, grandiose or full of pride or think you're so effing whatever. Um, that's not on as far as I'm concerned. And that's why I'm, uh, and I want to apologize because you guys wouldn't have known about it, but then, then what kind of person am I basically if I'm trying to be, um, huh, the four tenets. And I even did a separate video with Zoe about the four tenets when I was talking about this because I was so ashamed afterwards. And the first one is have fun. How in the world am I supposed to have fun if um, I can't be honest with you people? That's just, that's just ridiculous and I can't be mature. That's ridiculous. What's the second one? Be respectful to your opponent, your viewers. How the hell can I have done that if I uh, tried to pretend and uh, wiggle my way out of something like that? Own up to it, Chris, man. Like, you know what I mean? Grow up. Uh, what's the third one? Learn. Well, if I don't admit uh, the fact that I would have tried to fiddle my way out of this or something like that or cover it up or whatever, then, uh, or to stick up for my false pride or be grandiose or any of that crap, immature ego, that kind of stuff, then I'm not learning. It's as simple as that. And what's the fourth one? Try real hard. Well, obviously I'm not trying real hard if I don't do this video as far as I'm concerned and anyways I'm not here to I don't want to hear any comments about uh, that's not what I'm doing it for oh Chris would have no this is about me uh I don't want to call it penance or whatever I, I'll have to look that word up obviously um no it's about me just being trying to grow up is what I'm trying to say and I want to have a good time with you guys I'm not going to be able to have a proper good time with you guys if I'm not honest that's as simple as that how am I supposed to be? How are you supposed to trust me as anything if I'm not honest with you? Or even do you ever even want to play with me? That type of stuff. 
it's not on man so that's it um yeah i'm just gonna go i'm uh, gonna start to, i've got to finish up a bit of the um my chronology book thing there i think i've got uh not much left i think oh no i've got the naval and overseas uh sections to go for april 2nd to the 8th and then the political that's about it but my god this day of this week is zipping by quick and of course uh, the miniatures is going to eat up the wednesday but um I'm like, holy F, uh, like, um, well, in fact, God, I've got days off, but I was like, uh, look at these split bobbing trick, uh, you know, Saturday is coming up for the live stream and I've got, uh, I've got to, you know, do some preparations for that kind of stuff, whatever. Oh, and I will end it on this note because I forgot to talk about it is why I was mentioning why I was so happy that I had watched Journey's End or finished watching Journey's End shortly after I'd watched Aces High. I can guarantee you I'm going to have to go look this up. Well, he's not going to, ad whatever, admit it. But um, there are so many freaking similarities between Journey's End, storyline-wise and character-wise, and Ace's High. Uh, it's, there's no, there's, I cannot see it being a coincidence. <laughs> so much so, sorry, I just coughed up some saliva. <coughs> oh, God. I told you, this one thing that's bad about me, I... Yeah, my salivary ducts, my God, if they block up, I'm in trouble. Um, it, it was so similar, I'm not kidding you, I could start predicting who was going to die or I could start figuring out the conversation in a sense um, because I was like, okay, that's that character's... Or I was like, that that exact scene, practic it, you guys just altered it a little bit. I'm not dissing it or whatever. And I like I'm saying, I like it that it was reiterated and it was a different way of looking at things. What the hell do you think I do? I'm doing... With 99 point up, well, wait until you see my miniatures rules. Uh, when you, you, you start watching them, or if you're you know, whatever you do, um, um, I was saying to Zoe, to be honest with you, it's primarily just for me to hang out with Charles and whatnot. If anybody else, I'm not saying whatever, I'm not saying like you're not welcome, that's not what I'm saying. I'm just saying that my primary focus when I wanted to do this miniatures live stream, and he may not even, you know, he may be sick or has a gazillion things to do today. Um, I'm just doing my thing, and if he pops on, he says, hello, whatever, but it's just, uh, that was kind of like a, I just wanted to chit chat with him and so on and so forth. Um, and also I need some serious play testing with, um, um, my miniatures rules. So you're going to see, um, that was it. Uh, that was it. Yeah, I think so. Sorry guys. That's all I can say. Hopefully I'll be a better, uh, player and a better person, uh, going forward. That's it. And like I said, I don't want to hear about any, Oh, Chris, whatever, comment. No, no, no. None of that nonsense. Just let's get on with things is what I'm trying to say. Okay. See ya. Ooh, Jesus.